Autumn is also known as fall because well it's the season when leaves fall down in countries where the climate is cold in winter and warm in summer lots of trees are deciduous which means they lose their leaves in autumn the leaves first turn into different colors and eventually fall off all around us leaves turn yellow and look a bit dry and crusty so when a breeze comes along those leaves seem to fall off It sounds reasonable and simple but there's actually much more to it. While we might take this for granted and not think much about it, it's actually a very important process that allows deciduous trees to survive the winter. Let us first see how a leaf falls off the tree. When the days get shorter and colder, it triggers a hormone in trees which sends a chemical message to the leaves. Once they get the message small cells appear at the place where the leaf stem meets the branch they are known as abscission cells within a few days or weeks leaves develop a line of cells that push the leaf away bit by bit so while this may seem like leaves falling down a group of plant hormones such as ethylin abscisic acid and auxin direct the abscission process at the cellular level the tree is essentially giving each leaf a push they are ready to be kicked off then a breeze comes along to finish the job during the spring summer and early fall leaves make the food that helps the tree to grow develop and reproduce but when it gets colder and days are shorter food production slows down due to less sunlight trees can either keep the leaves or let them go but to keep them through really cold weather would use enormous amounts of energy producing more leaves would be a waste of energy because as temperatures near the freezing point the process of photosynthesis slows to impractical levels so the tree adopts a plan of shedding all its leaves the lovely colors we see are part of the dying process it's a way of protecting the trees and making sure they survive the winter and beyond if it didn't do it every year the water in the cells of the leaves would freeze and this would rupture them as water expands as it turns to ice the tree would be stuck with food stuff that is dead and could die also by the time summer ends most leaves have either been eaten by bugs or have decayed to some extent so this gives them a chance to start fresh The tree therefore prepares for this and starts taking nutrients out of the leaves when the days get shorter in autumn. This is when we can see them changing color. Once the chlorophyll disappears and starts degrading, other pigments such as carotenoids give leaves a burst of color. But there are some trees that hold on to their leaves all year long. These trees are called evergreens because they stay green all the time and the leaves don't fall off. The reason is that the trees have a thick coating that protects the leaves. This means they don't freeze and rupture like the leaves of other trees when it gets cold. In the spring, as the weather warms and the sap rises, the tree is green again. So leaves always fall. There's no getting around it. and now you know why thanks for watching and give this video a thumbs up if you like it